Why don't you tell me about yourselves? You wanna go first? Okay. I'm Shelby. I'm a senior at Loyola. I study multimedia journalism and I have minors in Asian studies, anthropology, and poli sci. I'm originally from South Dakota and I don't know what else you need to know about me. <laughs> yeah. Then um, my name is Deanna. I am a senior. I'm a creative advertising major with a minor in visual communication and I am from a suburb called Park Ridge. Can you guys tell me what her campus is? Yeah, so her campus is the number one media online source for college women by college women, and it is an online magazine that has chapters at a bunch of different universities. 370 plus. Numbers. Um, and we are the CCs for the Loyola chapter. Loyola chapter is here to empower, inspire, and inform. So we're here to be a platform for young creative women, women who want to, and for all people, we can, we have male writers, um, it doesn't matter if you identify as a woman to write for us, and mm -hmm. the target audience doesn't always have to be women either. We're here to be a platform to create, whether that's writing articles, if you want to get help interviewing, if you want to be an editor, social media work, videography, photography, graphic design, we're here to do it all. What's your favorite part about being on the eboard? <laughs> well, I think, I no, actually, I take that hmm, back. It is being able to physically see all of your hard work paying off. It's also so much fun to be able to finally, like, have responsibility for more than just your own articles that you're putting out and to be able to, like, really pour love into a group that I've been in love with for four years yeah. is really fun. Saga approved, so we can't rent out rooms. So we're always like, meet at this coffee shop, <laughs> meet at the second floor at Damon, like, hope there's enough room for all of us. Yeah, like, and we always end up just kind of like, there are just so many girls that end up coming that whoever's there just leaves. Like, whoever's there, they're just kind of heads out and they're like, I'm sorry. Because you see that dog. So earlier you talked about how you're not Saga approved. Mm. What does that mean? Take it away. <laughs> <laughs> Who wants to get into this? So, um, Her Campus National, Her Campus Media LLC, it's a national organization. Um, it is not a nonprofit. They are partnered with a plethora of brands, and sometimes we receive samples, um, survival kits, face masks, skincare, they get brand deals. Yes, they get a lot of and we receive those. So, we are technically not a nonprofit organization. To be an organization on Saga, you have to not get outside funding from other places. And even though we don't get money from nationals, we do get free products from nationals to promote on our social medias. So we can't be a group here on campus, technically. Um, not being Saga approved means that you cannot have any flyers on campus because those all need to be signed off by the office. Um, we're not allowed to rent out any rooms, conference rooms, the Damon Den, anything. Can't promote ourselves at the org fair. That's a big one and that's you know usually how you get your initial membership is you know at the org fair or by doing the flyers leaving flyers on the tables in Damon. Do you think Loyola can do anything to improve like the miscommunications between that type of stuff? We're hoping that they'll be willing to sit down and listen to us explain that we are not a for-profit group ourselves. We're hoping that Loyola will stay open-minded and yes. will realize that her campus is on 300 plus chapters or college campuses across the U.S. and there are other private colleges that have her campus as organizations on campus. Mm -hmm. um, so I hope Loyola would realize the opportunity that we can bring to students here. It's so hard to like, it's hard to figure out what Loyola would want, like how they could improve because we haven't really been able to work with them at all in the first place. Like, yeah. We're like, hey. <laughs> Tune into our third episode of our podcast to like hear us talk about leaving. <laughs> yeah, well, we will be discussing that. Um, are there any last things you want to say? I'd like to actually say thank you for like yeah. thanking of us for this because it is really hard to gain recognition on campus a lot and like whatever way that we're able to just like you know give our pitch, give our message across to people, like we take it and we appreciate your time. Exactly. And. If you're interested in writing for her campus, anybody watching this, um, we'd love to have you. We always accept new members. Mm -hmm. um, just reach out to one of us, go to our website, all of our contact info is on there. Love to have you on our team. We do lots of fun events and we'd love to feature your creative work. Yes, quick plug for that. <laughs>